In the realm of digital engineering, where every flop in logic gate tells a story, welcome to Texas Instruments, a pioneering force in semiconductor manufacturing. Texas Instruments stands as a beacon of innovation in the semiconductor realm, pioneering breakthroughs that shape the very fabric of modern technology. From embedded systems to 5G communications and beyond, TI's commitment to excellence is the driving force behind their cutting-edge solutions that power everyday devices we rely on. In line with this spirit of meticulous innovation, today's episode of the Interview Insights with TI focuses on the digital interview process. Join us as we share a few tips to excel in this field with the help of our engineers. Hi, I'm Arvind and I'm back to be your guide through the world of digital engineering here at Texas Instruments. Let's dive in. First and foremost, remember, during this process, it's important to articulate your thoughts and problem solving process. Don't hesitate to ask questions when you're unsure. How you approach and analyze a problem often matters as much, if not more, than the final answer you arrive at. What I mean is, don't do this. Instead, you could try this. Can I assume that the delays of all the gates are identical? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. One of the ways to manifest a well-organized thought process is via clearly drawn structures and timing diagrams. Let's start with how not to go about it. A messy block diagram or timing diagram can in fact lead you astray as you work towards your solution, while a well-drawn one can make the answer pop out easily. At TI, we expect engineers to be reliable and set a high bar for themselves when it comes to quality. So, for the given data, can you come up with a formula in terms of Y? Maybe Y squared plus Y minus 2. Can you uh, check that once? Yeah, looks okay to me. Does it uh, work for Y is equal to 1? Oh, uh... More often than not, the key difference between a successful design or debug and an unsuccessful one is the determination to say, let's give it one more shot. Embrace the challenge of the unknown, relying on your foundational knowledge and seeking guidance from your interviewer. After all, this is how the actual work is going to be. How you deal with new or incremental data thrown at you by the interviewer is also an important criterion. Here, more than anything, we are looking at your willingness to adapt and improvise. Are you familiar with CMOS logic gates? Uh, no, actually we are going to cover that in the next semester. I can um, you know, tell you about the basics. Are you uh, willing to give it a shot? No, I don't know this topic. Hesitation is natural, but getting past it is what will set you apart. Let's try that again. Are you familiar with CMOS logic gates? I can give you the basics to get you started off. Sure, I can give that a shot. I'm not sure how far I'll get with it though. That's okay. Let's start off assuming that a MOS transistor is an ideal switch and let's take it from there. Sure, let me give that a try. It's that simple. The skills and insights you gain along the way will serve as your compass in the ever-evolving landscape of technology. All you have to say is, let's give it one more shot and you'll eventually get there. With that being said, that's it for today. We look forward to welcoming you to our team at Texas Instruments, where your passion for digital engineering can find its true home. <laughs>